Hey guys, well, things are getting interesting and fired up, no pun intended. After getting two character-based episodes of Melton Asuna, these episodes are nice and debuts a really kick-ass form. In episode 11, Wiseru is trying to get the May Volcano to join him while the Ryu soldiers are also trying to get him to join, but that's not gonna work. He loves to ask quizzes and if you get it wrong, he shoots fire at you. Meanwhile, he has a bond with a little kid named Haruto and wants Ko to save him with the Marimara Soul. In episode 12, Teramigo is jealous of everyone talking about the May Volcano and Wiseru is still trying to get him on his side. After many trials and errors from the Minosaur, Teramigo is motivated thanks to Ko and finishes off the Minosaur with Kishirio Dime Volcano and Gaisorg shows up at the end. <laughs> While I can't agree that these episodes weren't as good as the previous two, they're still nice to see. The story for the most part is average and silly, but doesn't distract everything. The action is still awesome, the characters are good, the origins of Dime Volcano is interesting, and the arrival of Guy Sword is cool. I thought he was never going to show up after the Super Sentai Saikyo Battle Special, and it's great to see him again. The idea of a Kishiryu being friends with a human is neat, and I'm curious if there's more Kishiryu that are friends with other people. That and I enjoy Dime Volcano playing quizzes. It's kind of like how Dora Sphinx from Jew Ranger asked questions and took action. The cast did well and the only one that had a good focus was Dime Volcano. He can talk normal way before Terramigo did. He's powerful and scary to others, but he's kind and caring and has a likable charm that I enjoy. <laughs> Hell, even Wiser has a small good moment with Creon. <laughs> Speaking of Dime Volcano, I really like the design of him. The colors work for him, and the new armor on Ko looks badass. I love it, and the attacks he does is so damn awesome. What's also cool is Kishirio Dime Volcano. As much as I like it in the middle needle form, this one takes the cake. The firepower it has is good, and the weapons on fire with the great choreography makes this form even better. <laughs> Overall, these episodes were solid and some parts could be better, but it's fine in execution. The preview for the next episode looks fine and it seems that Bamba knows this lady and she's apparently part of the Russo tribe. Now that could lead into some good banter and plot details. Anyway, enjoyable episodes and the stuff we get later on are gonna be nice. Let's keep flaming on through this show and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching and as always, I will catch you later. Ta -ta.